going on with all my money motivated stars. Now this is going to be a sequel to the video I just made. It's not going to be about Charles White, but it's going to be about small minds and big minds. You know what I mean? Because I want to talk about how these celebrities are able to control the population. You know, it starts with people, it, it starts with um, self-judgment first. You know what I mean? A lot of people hate celebrities because of their self-judgment. Their, their self-assessment. You know, it's not it has nothing to do with sacrifice to Illuminati's. A lot of a lot of people just put that to the forefront because when you can make somebody else, you know, feel some type of way first by saying what they doing, it'll make you feel better about the life you live in. You know what I'm saying? When we all done did done stuff that we really didn't want to do or we didn't done stuff because not everybody did it you know what i'm saying we all we all done stuff that wasn't in our character at one point in time you know what i mean due to immaturity reasons you know not because we were psychopath or it just you know a lot of stuff we damn i shouldn't have said that to that person they probably hurt that person's feelings you know what i mean we all can be judged when it comes down to it but to get into the small minds and big minds you really can see who the program is the programming is working on like i said when you go out into your day-to-day -day life when you search the comment section when you see certain type of videos when you see certain type of blogs and how they they are uh depiction on how situations went down you know it's a lot of storytelling a lot of capping that people just creating their head you know and this particular topic i'm talking about is the uh, the rapper named sweetie you know i'm not too fond with her music i'm not i don't know nothing about her music i just know she dated this rapper called quavo but I'm talking about uh, how people, how the small minds are talking about her. She wore a jacket in her music video, and it still like had like a sensor on it. You know what I mean? And nine times out of ten, when you see somebody walking with a jacket or clothing, any clothing with a sensor on it, it mean they got a booster or they uh, either stole the clothing. Clothing. But sometimes the people will forget to take it off. You know, now they had that happen before. You know, I can do is burn it off. But a lot of this stuff happened, so they, I guess they saw it in the music video. A lot of people <laughs> were sharing it, you know what I'm saying, making a lot of judgmental comments. But in my, in the back of my mind, you know, I'm looking at it, man, like, this how these folks play, man. They know, this is why, this is why I see it's going into, like, the video I just made about Charleston White. Charleston White is a true troll, you know what I mean? And a lot of these artists, just because they're not moving how, how Charleston White would move, they're trolling people too. You know what I mean? Like you think that nobody saw that sensor on her jacket and her team, her management. You know what I mean? They do little stuff like that. It's like those are the rappers' gimmick now. You know what I mean? You know, you know what I'm saying? Like a lot of a lot of these rappers, their music is not really worth listening to. And I ain't talking about Sweetie because I, I ain't never heard her music. But a lot of these artists not really talented. They just look good. They have a good social media presence. You know what I'm saying? There's no no talent, no real lyric, you know what I'm saying? Lyricism, no, it's nothing. You know what I mean? It's just ass and teeth with some of them. You know what I mean? And a lot of dudes are just holding a lot of money and uh, designer shoes, big chains. You know what I mean? We're, we're in a day and time where the rapper has to look like a rapper. You don't have to actually be able to have, have to rap. You know what I mean? I don't can't spit freestyle, you know. Even if it's a rope and freestyle. They, they won't even want to do that. It's just like, it's all about the look. Cars, clothes, the, the money, and you know what I'm saying? And the women. And, or vice versa. If it's the women, it's the men. You know what I'm saying? So, when it comes down to it, it's, it's, it's basically like propaganda. And a lot of these small minds are not able to reach a level of the big minds because they're so small-minded they're looking at the stuff that the big mind people are doing whether it's an untied shoelace you know what i mean people sitting back at home and they're so uncomfortable with themselves and like like charleston white said he used to look at the celebrities is up here until they start responding back to him off him trolling you know what i mean so now he's like my these folks just regular people but you got to realize what charleston white says a lot of people still looking at celebrities like they up here it's a lot of people look at youtubers like they up here you know what i'm saying not i'm not putting myself in the boat but it's a lot of people if they can watch you on the tv they feel like you're above them a lot of these people i'm not talking to my people because we already know what's going on in this matrix we we not 
we in this matrix, but we not of this matrix. We know what's going on. So a lot of these people still looking at people that like uh, on television like they're above them. No, you're not above nobody, in, and you're not under no underneath nobody just because somebody has the courage. You know what I mean? Because the only thing people are lacking is like the confidence, the courage. Just a lot of people have great ideas out there. It's just the confidence and the courage to speak or, cause it, it all stems from your hometown. A lot of y'all ain't starting YouTube channels right now because y'all worrying about what that person at work gonna think. Y'all worrying about what your family members gonna think. Y'all worrying about the people you went to school with, what they gonna think. Trust me, if you didn't know nobody where you, you know what I'm saying, what you was doing right now, and they, you know what I'm saying, they wouldn't have no idea. If, if YouTube had a block out your state button, you would start doing, you would start doing YouTube channel. You know what I mean? It's all about what the, the perception of what somebody else is gonna think. You know what I mean? That's why a lot of people don't have the confidence because they're still living under a barrel of judgment from the people who they know. It's not the people who you don't know, it's the people who you do know that's stopping you from achieving your goals. Forget them folks. A lot of them folks in high school, I ain't worried about you. And if they worry about you now, you must be doing something right. You know what I'm saying? But to get back to the uh, topic, these people, they, they, they do little things. They these folks may lose, leave their shoe untied. Come in the video with half a shaved mustache. You know what I mean? Something they know that's gonna get people talking because even though it may not be moralistic, <laughs> they say uh, there's no such thing as bad publicity. And it's true when it comes to trying to make it, you know what I mean? But I have morals, morals so you can't really control what somebody make up about you, a narrative on the internet, but I can control how I move, you know what I mean? To make, you know what I'm saying, the allegations on me be legit, you know what I mean? When I'm coming, when he, uh, he move like this, he move like this, we can see it, you know what I'm saying? But when it comes down to a lot of stuff that's out of my control, that's not to be worried about, because like I said, all publicity is good publicity publicity in their eyes so they'll do stuff like this somebody will come out wearing the trash bag you'll see uh kanye west making slave clothing you know what i'm saying kanye west all all in so many words tell you that he made the clothes like this because he know people gonna buy him because his name he was selling people clothing out of trash bags and they was buying them because it was ye it was easy you know what i'm saying kanye west was not doing it he was doing it to troll in a way of a intellect, like watch these people go by this. You know what I'm saying? Even though he's the, making people look like fools, but can you really blame him? The people who's going to buy this is actually the ones that making themselves look like fools. He's just showing people, like I can literally go put a price tag on a on a blank flip flop and put two thousand dollars on there and put Yeezy on there, and people are gonna go buy them. They be pulling people's brain stream so much you know we are and they always want to call the celebrities the puppets yeah they the puppets they the well-paid puppets but the people who send back the small minds judging these celebrities doing all this stuff y'all the slave puppets you know what i mean so it's, it's no it's no difference so would you rather be a slave puppet or a rich puppet i would rather be neither you know what i mean if you if you wanted to know what well, my thought was i would want to be neither you know what i mean like I don't, that's why I don't do antics. You know, it's, it's the certain ways that I can make a video go viral tomorrow, today if I wanted to. It's not worth it. It's not worth my integrity. Like, oh, he doing this, you know what I'm saying? It ain't, it ain't cause no, I'm gonna be looking like, damn, everybody judge me. I just did this just to get my family on. No, I'm gonna be judging myself at that point. You know what I mean? Like, I, can't, I cannot do, I cannot do anything that goes beyond my morals to make a quick dollar because it's so easy to go viral. We seen it from there. The hot tour girl, you know what I mean? Like you literally can say one word and go viral. If it's funny, that just shows you where society is when it comes to like, you know what I'm saying, this matrix and this internet. Like, I'm pretty sure, I hope she capitalized off that, you know what I'm saying? She probably sold shirts and everything. Just that viral moment. When you get a viral moment, you gotta take advantage of that because there's so many people with small minds, man. You know what I mean? Now, if you enjoyed the phrase and the saying and all that, that's cool. You know, if you want to uh, extend a hand and help that person with, you know what I mean, making you laugh, that's cool. But just giving just giving everybody, you know, that, that stardom, you know what I mean? There's it's so many funny people in this world. We got to stop overlooking people just because they not viral. There's a lot of special people in your life. There's a lot of special people 
in your uh, surrounding area. You know what I mean? So a lot of these people, man, a lot of small minds, man, they got to, if you a small-minded person, I'm just, just telling you, man, if you hate anybody out there, you hate any celebrity, and you small-minded, stop talking about them. Because when you talk about them, you give them energy. That's why they say there's no such thing as bad publicity. When you talk about people, you give them, give them energy. For example, it's like somebody, you at a job, you know what I mean? Because females like to, you know what I'm saying, talk. So when they go to work and they talk about a, a specific partner who they end up laying with, having, you know what I'm saying, S-E-X with they end up talking about this person and now they lead other women to this person because you, you bragged about them so good about what y'all did you didn't gave him you didn't gave him more energy more clout what they call you know what I mean so the fact that you speak on people that will bring more that will lead more people to them whether it's negative or bad because if you go to the uh, work talking about them talking about how he was you know what I'm saying bad and bad or, or bad you know what I mean if you keep on talking about that they gonna see, want to see why, you know what I mean? Some it might be a challenge for another woman. But, ah, he ain't do good. In, I'm gonna make him do good in bed with me. You know what I'm saying? It's just like if you don't want to give a particular entity energy, don't speak of them. Don't think about them because even your thoughts can make that happen. You know what I mean? Don't think about them. Don't talk about them. Don't look their way. You know what I'm saying? Don't go click on their channel if you don't like them. Cause it might be people who watch my channel who don't like me. Pretty sure, probably one percent, two percent. Clicking on my video, bro, is only gonna boost my energy. It's gonna boost my channel. It's gonna boost whatever ratings I got going. You know what I mean? So, giving you a word of advice: if you don't want my channel to go up, don't click on my video. Whether you hitting the dislike button or not, you're still sending energy my way. You know what I mean? Whether I say something. It sounds overly stupid to you. If you go talk to the next person about their, your brother, your sister, you're still giving me energy. Your brother finna go check me out. Your sister finna go check me out. They may agree with what I said and you didn't. Those people gotta fail to realize, man, all that hate still is gonna come back to that person being successful. Cause that's like I told y'all in previous videos, that's what makes people be successful more. The hate. The hateful people gonna share your video quicker than the people who just watch your video. Like I said, the people who watch your video, they gonna like, oh, okay, I agree with him. I might send this to my cousin or my nephew, but they gonna leave it alone after that. But the person who hate you, they gonna put it on their timeline, they gonna put it on their Twitter, they gonna put it on their Instagram. Like, this man is so stupid. They gonna send it to group chat 20 people just because they don't like you and they want you to look stupid. But the whole time, we all perceive things differently. So the 20 people you just send it to, it may be 18 people who agree with what I said and the other two people agree with you. It's all, that's how energy works, man. We speak, why I say speak stuff into existence. And why I said, when it comes to the calm words, associate with negativity, but when you manifesting, that manifest word, it goes both sides. You can manifest negative and you can manifest positive. So just be careful and watch, uh, be careful with the words you choose. Be careful with the music you listen to. Be careful with the things that you view with these eyes. Be careful with the things you eat. It's all about caution and what you give energy to. Now, is you gonna give energy to a burger today? Or are you gonna give energy to a salad? Y'all let me know in the comment section, man. Y'all be blessed on walking and smoking. Hit the like button if you like the content.